Hell yeah. What's up, guys? This is Curse Pike. My friends call me Big C. Back in action today. I'm back using the heartbeat tool like I do. And I just want to say a few things. First off, I want to say thank you to the over 2,000 people that are now using the tool and making money. That's pretty cool. Uh, also, we just sent out, I think, 2,000 plus payments the other day, April 14th or April 18th. I can't remember my days very well. And uh, yeah, lots of money being sent out, lots of people creating content. And one of the things I want to do here is I want to do some feature spotlights. Like I said, we got 2,000 plus people using the platform. And today, I want to show you it's car time. And in particular, I want to show you what I like about his channel. So join me, h.ki. We're doing heartbeat. We're doing a feature spotlight. Let's go. All right. So if you're following along with me, just head over to h.ki. That's how you get into the heartbeat tool here. Also, you'll see the little heartbeat in my Google Chrome toolbar. So you know it's working and we're in the business. The next step, if you want to follow along with me or if you want to add It's Car Time, I recommend you do if you like cars especially. On the left side here, we got two options. I got heartbeats I follow. This is the one I generally click on. And I know that this guy right here in the middle is it's car time because I watch his videos a fair bit. So there you go. There's the first way to do it. And if you don't have anyone you follow or if you're not sure if you follow someone, click on creators here. And then this way you can see all of your followers in a nice, easier to see format. So nice and digestible. Or you can also go ahead and click on last updated. So I know that these are the people that have last updated their profiles and last created moments. Finally, if you're still not sure and you want to find someone, you can just type their name in and it will go ahead and do a search for you. And there we go. So that's the multiple ways to go ahead and find follow people. All right. Now we're on his page. Let's get into it. All right. Here we go. So here I am on his page. I'm just going to scroll down a little bit here and you'll see here we have a whole bunch of different options. Of course, I recommend checking out all of them. But the one that I want to show you is the moments tab here. When I click on moments, I can see up to the minute basically of every moment that he has created across all the various videos. Now, these are all great. Don't get me wrong. I like this race one here. But the one that I want to show you is down a little bit further here. It's this one right here. Cheap race cars. This got me thinking when I was a young guy. I like to drive fast. I don't anymore because I'm old and middle-aged. <laughs> but when I was young, I like to go fast and I didn't have a lot of money. So I was like, okay, well, let's see what the cheapest race cars are. So we can go ahead and just skip through this here. He's got a whole bunch here. I'm going to click on the first one, the BMW 325i E30. I knew lots of kids that driv drove this when they were younger, uh, when I was younger, part of me, and they were rich. And I still probably don't like them because they're rich, but whatever. Let's go. Let's take a look. So there we go. You'll see here right before I show you anything more, I clicked on that moment and look at this on the right side here. We can see a whole list of moments and these are very clearly his favorite cars out of the group. And if we look at some of the names here, 325iE30, Nissan 300ZX, Z32, Volvo, Volvo 740. Okay, let's look at that one. That, a Volvo, everyone drove Volvos because they were safe. But whatever, let's click on the first moment here. Let's take a watch, and then we're gonna click on a few more and show you what we got. 20 is one of the most iconic track cars in the world. Just an absolute monster. The BMW 325i E30. Yep. The E30 M3 in particular was an absolute homologation hero. Like we all know the history about those cars. They're okay, so he just said the word homologation. And not only that, he said homologation hero. That's an automatic thumbs up. I don't even know what that word means. But I like it. And I like the fact that he not only used it in a sentence, he used it in a video. All right. So another one I want to show you is the Volvo 740. But you can very quickly see how cool this guy's content is. So if I go to the Volvo 740, let's take a look at that one. This one, uh, if, you, if you've watched any YouTube on books. planet Earth of like a track day, then you've seen these cars. The Volvo 740. They're, the Volvo 740, the Volvo 240, the Volvo S60. There's all kinds of Volvos out there that you could buy and you could have a, ton, a, a, a huge amount of fun at a track with. But I went with... What the heck? So not only is it fast, it's good in accidents. Holy smokes. I actually had no idea. So again, I could show you more of those, 
but I want to show you a little bit more of his channel. So let's dig in a little deeper and check out some of the other videos that he liked. All right, so I'm back on his homepage here. And one of the things I like to do before I decide if I'm going to follow someone is I'll just sort of flip through some of these tabs and see what's going on here. So I'll click on favorites and right away, I can already see that he has favorited George's last video. And if you don't, if you ask me, that makes me, you know, want to question his judgment. <laughs> just kidding, George. This is a great video. We appreciate him putting that as a favorite. But again, we'll click on videos, for example. So here I can get a quick overview of the videos as opposed to the moments. So I'd look through here and I can see he's got a nice mix of gaming. He's got some Minecraft in there. He's got faceless channel stuff. He's got some heartbeat stuff here, some animation video. Like he's got quite a diverse type of stuff. And then, of course, uh, his go-to, which is all the different cars, including the 78 Chevy Malibu Burnout. Wow, I had a friend that had uh, like an 82 Cutlass or something. And he did the same thing, and it got really weird, but very cool. And then what else? I mean, we'll click on his playlist here. He's probably got a bunch of stuff here. So if I'm kind of looking for something like best cars under 5K, because I don't have a lot of money, I would click on that playlist. So there's just a few of the things here that you can get through just clicking on his channel, checking out his page. Again, primarily moments. Take a look through here. There's all sorts of other moments that you'd probably want to watch. I'm kind of interested in this Malibu rocket ship. But there you go, guys. It's car time. Check out his channel. Add him. Follow him. He'll follow you back. I'm sure of it. We're all going to build this up together, guys. Thanks for watching. Tumblr stuff coming up. Stay tuned.